what is up guys welcome back to my youtube channel i'm so sorry that i look like a avatar or a smurf you pick i wanted to do a cute little mask for my thumbnail but now it's just getting patchy like i swear it didn't look like this so today i'm gonna be doing my skincare routine um it's not too much it's not like too much going on with it um it's pretty simple yeah, i'm just basically gonna take you guys through my morning routine after i'm gonna show you guys my nighttime routine i'm gonna do it here because my bathroom is super tiny a mask made my uh skin very very shiny this is the cosmetics detox activated charcoal mask um i think i got it in a boxy charm i don't really know i don't really use cleanser mostly like at nighttime because they say in the daytime if you use cleanser it's like removing all the products that you use in the nighttime so use cleanser at night at night next thing i do is shave my face use the eucerin hydration lotion it's the big bottle um i used to use the cetaphil one i don't know i heard it's not really too good uh supposedly like it's got a lot of like i don't know stuff in it i have been using these plum beauty shavers which are really good i got them at target um super good you can also take the blade out like you just slide it and it's like so out so we're just gonna shave our face so i just wanted to share another face mask with you guys that i would probably do uh before starting my morning makeup routine it would just probably be the uh, Ordinary BHA Peeling Solution, this red one from The Ordinary. And I just realized pretty much everything here is from The Ordinary, just letting you know. But yeah, this one's pretty good. Um, it's the one that turns your face red. But it's pretty good. One more peach fuzz. Um, I take my Holy Grail, Paula's Choice. Paula's Choice, guys. Paula's Choice Exfoliating Liquid Solution. Liquid Exfoliant. If it would have been for this, you know, this little scar I have up here... That little coloring scar that I have there. Um, it wouldn't be there because I didn't know about this and I would always pop my pimple. I use the uh, Ordinary Buffet in the morning because I noticed that when I use the niacinamide and the hyaluronic acid in the daytime, it makes my face like white and crusty. It leaves like a little bit of like crust and it dries, so I use it for night. I don't care if I'm crusty at night. I just put like a little bit of this Buffet serum. This is good because, you know, serums are good to prevent... Uh, your wrinkles and all that. It's good to use at the, the area of your smile. I do love to use the Isialic Acid Suspension from The Ordinary. Um, I know this one they say it's really good to prevent like little forehead bumps. Yeah. But once again, just the Eucerin Moisturizer. I like how this is my morning routine, my morning skincare routine, and I'm just filming it casually at 3.18 in the afternoon. <laughs> I wish it was 3.18 in the morning. What a productive morning that would have been. Also, wait for your products to dry. So the last thing I like to do sometimes is just put on a little bit of oil. Um, this coconut oil from Pearl Essence is a little, it's pretty good to use. Um, I think I got it at TJ Maxx. That is perfect, and we'll work for the other side too. There we go, look at that glow. I pretty much just use this mostly when I feel like my face is dehydrated. She wanted to be in my video. Okay, so, of course I go in with some more Paula's Choice because you can never get enough of this stuff. And then, just everywhere. It also, like, it's an exfoliant, so it also can help remove, like, any excess makeup that, you know, the, um... The makeup remover didn't remove but of course if i was having like foundation then i would use like a like rock exfoliator or something like that to remove the foundation and then i don't really use foundation so usually every night i also whenever i remember <laughs> that these exist i use the uh pixie eye patches they're supposed to help with your under eyes hopefully it's doing its job because maybe who knows maybe my under eyes would be way worse if it wasn't for this but yeah um, there's another thing that after you could put for your under eyes that i usually use for mine it's just the ordinary uh, caffeine solution. See, see all that crust? Like if it was a Nature Valley bar. And then you just put it there. Next thing I go in with, I already have a new one. I ordered a new one, but this one still has a little bit in it. It's just the niacinamide because it also helps with forehead bumps.
I swear there's stuff in there. The last thing I use is just the hyaluronic acid. Just a little bit of this. I don't like to use this in the daytime because I uh, do get crusty like on my face. Like now my face is going to get crusty. But it's alright. I'll be fine. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. Uh, thank you so much for watching. And I'm not very good with skincare. I don't know much about it. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Bye.